Mum, Ruth Jonas from Finchley in North London, has been on maternity leave. She'd like to get back to work, but the cost of decent local childcare means financially it would be a struggle. Childminders are normally around here about £65 a day. Um, uh, and nurseries could be, for a sort of day rate, could be up to £110, £120 a day. One job I applied for was similar to a role in an organisation I applied for almost 10 years ago, and it was the same salary. New figures from the TUC show across the country childcare costs are rising much faster than our pay packets. Since 2008, wages rose by 12% but childcare increased by 48%. And here in the capital, the price of childcare rose nearly seven and a half times more quickly than Londoners pay. The government has doubled free childcare for working parents of three and four year olds to 30 hours a week. But some nurseries and preschools can't afford to do it as they claim there's a funding shortfall from the government. While others say they've passed on the cost of looking after children aged two and under to working parents. I think some help with Funding for under one, for the one for one to three year olds would be really helpful. Um, I get the impression that it's hard for nurseries as well. They don't get enough money to kind of reduce the cost either. So the so if the cost could come down, that would make it much more manageable, like in other countries. We know that that period between ending parental leave and getting your free nursery place at two or three is really difficult for families. However, there's struggles right up the age group and we need to think about a childcare strategy that works for all families and all children, particularly including school aged children. The government claims it saved parents thousands of pounds a year and helped many get back into work. As for Ruth, she's still looking for a job in London that would pay enough to cover the cost of childcare. Aisha Baksh, BBC London News.